Hey guys, Captain here. So I know a lot of people like to collect Lego minifigures. In fact, some people like uh, minifigures more than they like actually uh, building stuff out of Lego. And um, I've seen lots of people build really beautiful displays for their minifigures, you know, basically uh, like picture frames and they'll have something so they can stand all the minifigures up in them or they'll rig something so that the minifigures are basically hanging there, you know, tied in with some kind of string or wire. You know, I've seen lots of stuff like that. But uh, this is a design that I thought is really clever. It's by the Bricktime team, but I felt like I just have to show off the instructions for it because it's super neat. Uh, it's a really nice way of storing um, Lego minifigures, you know, intentionally on shelves or something along those lines, or a desk. And um, it's very simple to make, and it's made out of Lego. And so what's very clever about this is that um, you can store a minifigure in front here, and then when you build more of these, you can keep them attached together with other minifigures. So if you have n of these little bases, you can store two n minus one minifigures. That means if you have five of them, you can store nine. If you have 20 of them, you can store 39 minifigures, you know, quite a few. So um, building them is very simple. And what's great is that a lot of times you can build these things out of pieces just found on pick a brick walls. Um, the really hardest part to acquire probably is going to be um, the slopes, these curved slopes, which come in a variety of colors as far as I'm aware, at least all like the, the main colors. And then uh, headlights or modified bricks with a stud on one side or Technic bricks. Technic bricks don't come in so many colors, but I think headlights come in quite a few. So, um, you know, they should be pretty easy to use. So what you need for this is you need two of these sloped bricks. Um, you need four headlights or modified bricks with a stud on one side. In fact, pick a brick walls right now as of making this video, so I don't know when it'll get posted, but basically until the end of March, and maybe even a little after that if they didn't all get used up, we'll have gray uh, modified bricks with uh, one stud on one side, light gray. So you might want to pick up some of those. You'll need um, two sets of one by six worth of bricks doesn't matter if you use like a four and a two or three threes it really doesn't matter you need a one by four or even just two one by twos will work uh, you need two one by twos and then you need a one by two plate two one by four plates and a one by four tile and uh, ideally you get this all in the same color maybe you can be fancy and make a really nice design out of it out of not having it all the same color or you can have other stuff sticking out of it or whatever and if you don't care for color scheming, well, I'm just assuming you probably don't care for minifigure storage that much either. But um, anyways, so you start with one by six worth of bricks. You place a one by four worth of bricks to hold that together. And then some headlights facing up. And then on top of that, another one by six worth of bricks. Then on the sides, you place the one by twos and centered you place um, more headlights, or as I'm going to demonstrate, you know, a minifigure like this with a dress won't fit on top of headlights, so we can take some modified bricks. And I'm pretty sure she'll actually cover the very top of it, so we'll be fine on that. So you stick these here, and then place two one by four plates, holding that together in the center, a one by two plate. Our sloped bricks should fit in pretty obviously and then smooth out the top with a 1x4 tile. And notice if we have a minifigure like this, you can't even tell that that's yellow underneath. So we stick this together. This minifigure holds it together. We can display another minifigure here. And ta-da! A very simple display for minifigures. It's not very stable when you pick it up, of course, because it's being held together by just one minifigure. If you want to be... if you really want to go for stability, you could um, use some Technic bricks right here and just have a pin hold it together additionally, you know, or really elsewhere. Um, but up here would probably be most stable in addition to the minifigure. So uh, with that though, if you like this video, please rate, comment, subscribe. Check out my other ones, send this to your friends, and I will see you guys next time.